The all-you-can-eat buffet everyone's talking about today. We're at the Palm in Oldham. Come down with Nirvana and MC Chowdhury. Yes, we're off to the Palm Suite. Are we ready to spit bars a bit out there? It's not discreet. Straight into the food, they've got this starter section. You've got your pizza, your chips, all your salad stuff, all your different sauces, poppadoms, barges, chutneys, you name it. They've got it. So it's £20 a person, all you can eat. Drinks are an extra cost. No alcohol, but they do have a great variety, including this mango lassi. So here's my first plate. I ended up getting sucked in by the starters. I got pizza, poppadoms, chips, barges, a little bit of everything, mate. Got a bit of poppadom there with a the chilli sauce. And yogurt sauce. I'll start off with poppadoms at any Indian, aren't you? Yeah. Them chili chips are well nice. Onion bhaji. Oh. Nice and crispy. Goes well with that chili sauce. And I've got like this fried potato thing here. Belting. Last but not least on my first plate. I've got pizza. And it's no frozen crap, it's proper fresh pizza. Bang on that. Spot on. Oh, I forgot about this little bar. I'm going to rub it in the uh, sauce. All in one, banging. Seen some more starters, so I had to get a plate of them for round two. We got some samosas, chapli kebab, Thai chicken, chicken wings, pakora, and chicken nuggets. Chicken wings. They're bad boy, them, aren't they? Nice, aren't they? On my review group, people's favourite phrases, piping hot. And they are piping hot. Fresh out the oven. Let's go, we got these chicken nuggets. You know what I mean? If you bring the kids, at least they've got these. Don't all people eat them regularly. This is the adult version. The chicken pakora. Much better. Again, piping hot. Veggie samosas, these aren't homemade. These are the uh, Cash and Cali ones, but it doesn't matter. The veggie samosa does the job. What else haven't I tried yet? Thai sticky chicken. Belting. Last but not least, the chapli kebab. Decent, but it needs some sauce for that or something. A bit boring on its own. So next up we have the lamb chops. Yes, you get unlimited lamb chops at this buffet. You just ask the chef, give him your table number, and they bring them over to you. Look at these. Look at these. <laughs> Try them lamb chops, lads. Wow. They're mega. Yeah. Belting. Had to get some more drinks in before we started on the mains. Got a jug of this. Can't remember what it's called, but it tasted like WKD without the alcohol. As you can see, Nirvana got stuck right in, and it must have been nice because he started necking the whole thing in one. Is it nice, huh? Oh, shit. <laughs> on to the mains. He had so many curries to choose from, but I feel like my videos weren't as good as what they could be because it was a Saturday night and it was so busy, and I felt like I was getting in everyone's way. But anyway, for my third plate, I managed to get a chicken curry, a a lamb curry, a bit of rice, and a fresh chapati. As well as the lamb chops, you can also order some noodles fresh to your table. So we got some chicken noodles as well. This curry is mega, both of them. It's proper authentic tasting. Yeah, yeah. Is it Pakistani? Yeah, yeah. Pakistani this. Yeah. We get a chicken shag. The chicken shag and <laughs> lamb, whatever, but it's well nice. <laughs> I'm in heaven. I'm in heaven. <laughs> Got the curry on the fresh chapati there. Heaven. Some chicken noodles there. Oh, they're well nice. Nice catch, mate. <laughs> After three plates, I was full up. I wish I didn't fill myself up so much on them starters, but it always happens at these buffets, doesn't it? 
I could just about manage to get a dessert in. They had a good range of cakes, including all this ice cream. I think we filled ourselves up too much on drinks as well. We ended up getting some more mocktails, which were a lot nicer than that one we got in the jug. Highly recommend the mocktails, guys. MC Chowdhury doesn't do cakes, so he got himself some bubblegum ice cream, some jelly, and a bowl of custard. I like being back in bleeding primary school, but then again, who doesn't love a bit of custard? I could drink pints of that stuff myself. I was gonna say I was jealous, but I wasn't because I got some chocolate fudge cake and lemon drizzle cake with custard. You get your money's worth for 20 quid here, guys. <laughs> Sorry, we're just having some guy on the table next to us. He's literally had about 12 plates and he's just gone getting another. Unbelievable. Oh, cake and custard. You can't beat it. Come oh, on. So yeah, we well got our money's worth, guys. And this building is beautiful and it's absolutely massive. They also cater for weddings. They can fit up to 900 people. So if you're planning on getting married soon, definitely consider this place. Big up the palm. See you on the next one, guys.